Welcome back to another Brick of It video. In today's video, we have a little bit of a Brickmania haul, kind of an in-store road store haul, also an online store haul. So yeah, we'll get through it. Um, yeah. Oh, the official yeah, opening of your K bar, which you discovered. Well, no, I knew where it was. I just didn't know no, exactly where it was. Knife. Okay, hold on. I think I have to open it from the back. Yes, first rule of opening a Brickmania, Brickmania, Brickmania package is open it from the bottom. Now, I don't know exactly what this is. No. We've been sitting on these packages for quite a while, but here we go. Motorcycle with Sidecar, World War II German Light Transport. Um, we probably will do a short review on this, uh, like a like an actual like short um, vertical format kind of thing. So yeah, be looking out for that. But anyway, so yeah, I love the two minifigs in this. I was not consulted on the purchase of this. Dave just did it without my consent. But Hey, certain things I mean, I know I have carte blanche authority. Kind of, maybe. Simply. What does carte blanche mean? That means I can do it when I want to do it with your authority. You giving me authority to do whatever I want. I don't know about that. But anyway, what it's I a cool. now is $50 from your wallet. How so? A down payment on my greatness. Be Dude, on the lookout. stop it! I'm telling, this guy is freaking me out up here. Look. Look, just stare at that. If anybody, probably no one has seen the video. There's a video that came out in 2020, but um, yeah, there was this company that charged an absorbent amount of price for 3D printing and scanning your head. And this was me like five years ago. <laughs> it's and it, creepy. It doesn't matter where you are in the room, you're always looking. You're yeah. like Chucky. Yeah, it's uh, very disturbing, but uh, go watch Brother that video. Brother of Chucky. Um, we were at, so give some context, we went to um, Brick Fan Expo, Nashville Brick Fan Expo, if you're watching, great event, um, it was really good, had a great time, uh, shout out to Steven who came by our table and shouted out that he watched the channel and everything, so shout out to you man, thanks for watching, but um, anyway, it was a great show, I really had a good time, and um, yeah, it was, so it was an awesome event, and um, I hope Brick Fan Expo comes back, the crowds weren't as good as I think it should have been. Um, I don't know why that was, but a great event. Tome so many great people. A lot of the Brickfair people actually were there, which is really nice to see. And also great builds as well. Um, I didn't really film much there. There's a couple clips I think I filmed and a couple pictures, so those will be showing up on screen. Um, but yeah, it was a really fun event. We were having too much fun to film. Yes. Anyway, Dan was there mm -hmm. with the Brickmania booth, and we were set up right opposite from him. And yes. I don't know. I had a burning. I had I had some extra cash in my pocket. This is it a dangerous burn, thing. Burning, a, burning a hole in it, and then I saw Bob and Doug. Even though he didn't have extra cash, he had a card. But anyway, Bob and Doug McKenzie. Um, I am not exactly sure what this is, but Dave does, and Dave is in love. Oh, we're gonna apparently. we're gonna watch Strange Brew maybe tonight. Can't They're wait. hilarious. Anyway, there you go. But um, cool mini things. Um, they were comedians they were cool. that were very popular, I guess, in the early '80s. They put out a record, and they appeared on TV, and they were funny as all get out. There you go. Awesome, awesome uh, details. And there's five different ones, so this is gonna be awesome. I don't know what I'm gonna use it for yet. It'll probably be years before I actually use it in something, but we'll see. And this was a pre-order. I do know what this is. Um, so, Dave, are you excited about this? This is something that I wanted. So, um, yeah, here it is. We'll be doing a review, hopefully, at some point. Yeah, review of the surgeon sewing me up. This thing is tight. I love the, the tower in it. Um, the vehicle is very cool as well, but the tower is uh, really, really cool. So I actually saw this live in, at Brickmania GHQ um, when we went up there for World War Brick. So I actually know what this set looks like built, um, but yeah. Very, very excited about that. It's from the Indiana Jones movie. We have part one, two, um, and then we have five. I don't think we got three and four, which were both planes. I wasn't a big fan of those. Wait, there's more. I think these are freebies, because I, yeah, we definitely didn't order these, but these are freebie, 3D printed freebies, which is very nice to see. So maybe they're doing that with pre-order sets. Looks really cool, can't wait to build it up. Uh, still building bar to door right now. Uh, go watch the Thursday night live streams at about nine o'clock. Um, 
Central Time. We have a great time over there. Matthew's usually on. We got a bunch of people, so I'm trying to grow that. Been doing it for about 30 weeks now, um, and the viewership has it grown. Eh. Not really, but um, it stayed consistent. So uh, Canadian Bricks, shout out to him. He's always on every single live stream. So Canadian Bricks, I don't know how you do it, but thank you. And um, we just also got another haul, which I did a short on, but basically it was just like a ton of parts. Um, these are some of the parts here, but those were, um, anyway, but I'm trying out a new technique, which I all right, guys, so we're wrapping it up on the phone. A little sus, I know, probably the audio changes a little bit. But anyway, Dave, is there anything you want to say? Anyway, what I was saying is before the camera cocked, <laughs> before the camera croaked on us, um, I'm trying out this new technique, which I saw um, Caden at um, World War Brick, um, and he was trying out net technique for the first time. I think it was his first time. And so anyway, on this mock that I'm building up right now, I'm trying it out on the first time. And so let me know what you guys think. This is going to be a little round top. But we ordered a ton of BrickLink parts. Um, and so anyway, those came in and I did a short on that. So if you want to go see that, you can. Dave, anything? Have you thought of anything? Yes. Go to brickafig.com and buy some stuff. So you can I, get out of debts. Well, no. So I, I'll have some money in my pocket. So I'll be able to splurge and buy something that I want. Or we can get out of debt. Or that. 